Hi everyone, this is uh, Roberto Bonafont. I'm going to show you how to uh, create a mix video uh, so you can uh, learn how to flip your classroom by using PowerPoint. Uh, PowerPoint is available to any BOCES employee uh, for the cost, I believe, of $995, $998. You get the complete office suite. So uh, you'll be able to use Word, PowerPoint, Excel, Publisher, etc. And it'll only cost you $9.95. Uh, you can get with uh, Mr. Schroen and get the actual link. It, uh, it's uh, something that we've emailed out before, so you might want to search your old emails. Just type uh, Microsoft space H-U-P in caps, and that should bring up the email that uh, Mr. Schroen sent everybody on how to... Uh, get the uh, office suite at that at that reduced price uh, as a BOCES employee. Okay, moving on to uh, the mix. So here's, we've opened up PowerPoint, and if you'll notice here, if you go across, you'll have your regular menu of uh, items that you can click on, including your home uh, tab, which allows you to edit, add new slides, etc., to your PowerPoint design. Uh, the design itself, I've picked this uh, mixed green one here, but you can add whatever you want. Any transitions you want to add, whether you want it to come up from the bottom, the side, fade in, fade out. Animations, which actually uh, uh, do some real fancy stuff with your slide if you want to do that to attract your students' attention. Um, then, of course, this is how you would play your PowerPoint. You can actually uh, rehearse the timings if you want, if you're recording sound and you can record how much time you want on each slide to appear. Uh, now, the one I really want you to be aware of is the one that says Mix. When you go to your PowerPoint, you won't see this tab. You must download it. So you must go to the uh, Microsoft website and search for Office Mix, M-I-X. Once you get that add-in, download it, add it to your Office Suite, then you'll get this tab. And this tab allows you to do several things. Number one, it allows you to record um, the actual slide recording. You can record audio, video, and you can, of course, write on your slides. Um, Mix allows you to create quizzes. So you can insert a quiz or a video quiz or even another application, an educational application that may be available on the Microsoft website. You kind of have to research that yourself to see what, what's available. You can actually record the screen, so even while you're doing your PowerPoint, if you want to go to another website and show them that site, if you screen record, uh, it'll do the same thing as if you were using uh, Screenomatic, for instance. If you want to create a screenshot of a website, uh, it's a real quick snapshot of a photo or object or person, etc to insert into your PowerPoint, this is how you do it. Um, you can insert a video, so you can't have a video within a video. You just need to create the video with another webcam and then import it into uh, PowerPoint. Of course, you can insert audio, not just your narration, but you can also insert music, etc., to play while your slide is being presented. This allows you to preview your work um, I believe uh, if we click on it now, it'll show you um, the PowerPoint that I just created. It's called Creating a Mixed Video. Of course, there's no other video after this slide, so that's why this screen is blank. So let's get out of that presentation um, and take us back to the first slide again. When you create a mix in of an Office PowerPoint, you will need to upload it to what they call the Office Mix website. This is where you can keep it private, or you can share it, or you can actually view the analytics on usage and whatever quizzes you create. Uh, My Mixes, that's actual website that you have, or that you will have, once you open up an Office Mix account. It's free, you just need to register with a, a legit uh, web, web uh, address, or email address, I'm sorry. Uh, you can export the video that you create, so uh, the only problem when you export it is it is strictly uh, a video. 
so it won't allow you to see all the interactive elements like quizzes and analytics that you've created. Uh, export to Scrum, don't worry about that. Publish to Office 360 video. If you have an account in Office 360, you'll know what this is. Uh, using the mix, in other words, there's some tutorials you can see online. Just click on this and it'll take you to the tutorial site. Matter of fact, I think if we click on it, uh, we should be able to see it. Okay, there it is. Uh, okay, my battery is running low. Let me plug my PC in quickly here. So we don't lose this. So we don't lose this recording. Um, but if you'll notice here on the side, you have all the information in terms of what you need to know about creating a mix. And it's, it's all online, so you can always go back to it if you need to see it again. All right. And I think that's basically it. I think that's how you uh, do a mix. Um, just make sure you go through the tutorials. Uh, the tutorials should help you uh, uh, see the mix and the... Uh, and you'll be able to flip your classroom with no problem at all. And these are, this is software that you have available now, and uh, you don't have to go to the different sites to do it. You can do it all on one site. Okay, that's it for me. Uh, let me go ahead.